maintenance demonstration, we will fork the XTML editor source code to a personal repository. To do so, you'll click on the fork button located at the top right of the website. Then you'll choose the account that you want your repository copy to. Once the repository is copied over to your personal account, you can now import the source code into the Bridgepoint tool. To clone the Git repository that you forked, you need to open up the Git repositories view. To do so, click on the Window menu, the Show View submenu, and the Other button. Once here, you can navigate to the Git repositories view. Click the Clone a Git Repository button and clone the forked repository. When cloning a repository, always make sure to not put the repository into the Eclipse workspace. Once the repository is cloned, you can now import the source code from the XTML editor. To do so, right click on the repository and click the Import Projects button. Once the projects have been imported, you can begin making your modifications, building the source, and testing it.